The most exciting thing about working wafer is the ability to innovate while balancing between growth and efficiency. Marketing at Wayfair is a really unique department as it comes to marketing departments. We're really a growth driver and an engine of growth for the company. And we think of ourselves as a profit center, not a cost center like many organizations. Using data-driven approach, we tailor marketing journeys uh, to provide best-in-class experience to our customers. We're in the continuous hypothesis mode, testing new landing experiences, campaign setups, creative and targeting. I would say three things about marketing at Wayfair in EU are special and interesting. Uh, one, it's incredibly data-driven. Two, there's a reasonably quick loop to either delivering impact or learning what resonates with our customers. And three, everybody that works here is really inquisitive about learning about what makes our customers tick. What makes Wayfair um, a special working place for me is the, the possibility that is given to everyone to own a, a project or a channel end to end. So for me, it's uh, running email campaigns for a database of several millions of customers. And within this, this project, I feel like um, my manager is fully trusting me and offering his support whenever I need it. We are not responsible solely for optimizing and managing the channel itself, but also understanding what are the different drivers for the performance that we are getting. While Wayfair is a large and growing company, it feels like a startup. We're really scrappy. We have huge amounts of autonomy and ownership. I would say that we are growing at the moment mainly because of the people. We have a set of sharp and ambitious people right down from the analyst to the CEO. The team we're building here at Wayfair is really special. It's a diverse group of individuals, highly quantitative, but also highly creative. What makes the team so great is the close collaboration we have. You would not solely work closely with your partners on a certain project, but everybody would also spend a lot of time with you if you have any questions on whatever kind of gaps you have in your knowledge or if you want to understand something about the different channels that they are driving. The most important thing about uh, Wafer is uh, people that you collaborate in on a daily basis. It's absolutely incredible how much you can grow and how fast you can grow when you work with one of the most talented and smart people in the industry. Wayfair is a, is a great team because it's the right mix of uh, content focus and having great fun at the same time. So for example, during one single day, you'll have this conversation with your colleagues where you go super deep into very analytical or data-driven things. And one hour after, you'll be sharing cooking recipes. And that's great. Yeah, that's a good question. Why am I working at Wayfair? Um, so when I interviewed at Wayfair, something clicked for me that hadn't clicked for me in the other interviews I'd done at other places. I got a real confidence that I would be able to solve hard problems that haven't been solved before. And I felt inspired by the people that I'd met. And then I thought that I want to work at a place where I'd be inspired, challenged, and learn from the colleagues that uh, I want to work with. And all of that has been true every day and is true today. And that's why I come and work here. In the time that I have been here, one of the nice things that I've also seen is that we have been able to offer very rewarding career paths to a lot of people who started here with their first job and now are managing teams of three and four. And it's been amazing to see their growth. The most exciting thing about working Wafer is the ability to innovate while balancing between growth and efficiency. We operate with the best-in-class machine learning and MarTech solutions. This allows us to create marketing products that are years ahead of the industry. The main reason why I'm working at Wayfair is the exponential learning curve. If I look at where I was three years ago, where I'm at now, and try to anticipate where I will be in three years, I definitely want to stay.